idea what that noise is. Patina. I must make another patina video. And ranch. I'm out of ranch. How can this possibly? Peeked at a couple of these, so I'm kind of like, oops, I wrecked that one. Kind of blown away about what some of these look like. I actually was surprised. Although I don't really know how well these would work, honestly, because it's like food product so it's probably just gonna wash off the surface but some of the colors are really cool all right so the top row is all the condiments without salt and then the bottom is with salt salt really didn't do anything actually made it darker in some cases obviously the pesto I knew that wasn't gonna work really even though it has vinegar in it it's too greasy and nothing really forms with that this one is what really is cool oh god it's tainted that is the one the ketchup formed and it's not actually it's like it's almost like paint it, it's sort of dried on there I just put the little blotches on there to see if there were you know leave a blank area and see if that changed so anything with the ketchup up was on changed color in most cases it all, all the empty uh, you know, just the bare copper didn't form any kind of patina. Like, that one's a little tacky. Ketchup was the only one that really, like, dried to almost like a paint finish, which was kind of weird. Mustard. Yeah, the mustard's kind of dry, too. I don't know how you really could use this information, but... I thought it'd be fun to try and actually surprise at some of the results I got. So, hopefully, you enjoyed watching this. And stay tuned for future patina videos. Can't forget the ranch. Looks like toothpaste. Alright, till next time, folks.